Well, as Black History Month continues, we are asking ourselves tonight, should we cancel Thurston County? As the movement continues against racial injustice, America has had a reckoning, removing offensive symbols, renaming teams, holidays, even lakes. Statues have been removed and sports franchises completely rebranded. But what you may not realize, one of the most hateful historical legacies is right here in western Washington. So Fox 13's Jennifer Lee is going to lay out this case for you. She takes a closer look at the man Thurston County's named for and why some people are saying Samuel Thurston is not a name that should be honored. This is Samuel R. Thurston. Handsome. We went to Olympia, the state capital and county seat of Thurston County, where many take pride in the city's progressiveness. I've lived here for three years now, since 2019, and I really like it. Carrying a picture of Samuel Thurston, we started sharing about his legacy and the county's namesake. Reactions were all the same. That's pretty shocking and I don't love that. <laughs> that's a piece of history that's not great for us. Upon second looks, I think he's incredibly unattractive. <laughs> history tells us Thurston's most prominent contribution was the Oregon donation land law. He helped write and pass the legislation which promised hundreds of acres of land to white settlers, explicitly excluded blacks, and dispossessed land from Native Americans. Reading all of this, it began to seem to me very strange that we have honored uh, this man with uh, the name of a county, and not the name of any county, the name of the county in which the capital of our state, Washington, uh, resides. Ben Corey, a lifelong Washingtonian, started a petition online to rename the county. If there was a statue of the guy, we'd have problems, right? If there was a statue of Samuel Thurston in Olympia, there'd be an issue, and the statue probably would have been taken down by now. But the name of his name uh, is on the county, and so for the same reasons that the statue would have been taken down, we ought to we ought to at least consider renaming the county. In this letter from 1850, the Oregon Historical Society says Thurston wrote in support of yet another black exclusion law, justified slavery, and control over free blacks, using words such as quote ominous, evil, wretched, and blight to describe black immigration. For weeks, we reached out to local historians for their take on Thurston and his legacy. I am sorry, but I am not able to assist you with this request. Including the Thurston County Historic Commission. I presume you have seen the response from the county public information officer, and I will follow their lead. Eventually, we connected with Emmett O'Connell, who has a blog called The Olympia Time. He's written posts dating back to 2011 that say Thurston isn't a worthy candidate for the county name, and says, unfortunately, Thurston's legacy has continued forward. Even though the black exclusion law eventually was knocked off the books, Things like the Chinese police tax in the 1860s and the anti-Chinese riots in the 1880s and even things like the 1920s era anti-immigration laws which came from the, which were spawned by politicians in the Pacific Northwest, all tie back into the black exclusion law which was to make this place um, for white people only. O'Connell and Corey both point out Thurston actually never stepped foot into Washington state. The honor itself is almost like a mistake. And now they're hoping by raising awareness, it may start a louder conversation. I see us as a very progressive part of Washington, so I think that we would be a good place to start for something like that, for sure. Very progressive city, so it's yeah. surprising to know its origins. Yeah, let's change that name. Of course, renaming a county has been done before in our region. King County was renamed in 2005 to honor Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., replacing William Rufus King, a little-known vice president elected in 1853. Jennifer, are there any proposed names if they decided to throw out Samuel Thurston's name? Yes, so this was first home to the Nisqually tribe who called their land Tumwata, which is today's city of Tumwater. Records also suggest Thurston County was supposed to be named Simmons County after Michael Simmons, who led the settlement of Puget Sound, but he declined the honor at the time. Simmons's story also stands out for another reason. His friend and guide for the expedition was George Washington Bush, a black businessman and explorer who was among the first African-American landowners in the state of Washington. Back to you guys. All right, thanks, Jennifer. Still ahead.